Hello friends, this is our question and these are the options. Let's simplify this. First we will focus on this part. Let's write that separately. 1 minus square root of 5 upon square root of 20. Here we can take LCM. So it will be square root of 20 upon square root of 20 minus square root of 5 upon square root of 20. So it will be square root of 20 minus square root of 5 upon square root of 20. Square root 20 can be written as square root of 4 times 5 minus square root 5 upon square root of 4 times 5. Square root 4 is 2, so we can write 2 times square root 5 minus square root 5 upon 2 times square root of 5. From here we can factor out square root 5, so it will be square root 5 times 2 minus 1 upon 2 times square root of 5. 2 minus 1 will be 1, so we have square root 5 upon 2 times square root of 5. This square root 5 get cancelled out, so we have 1 upon 2. So let's put 1 upon 2 in place of this part. And our main equation is square root of 8 plus 2 upon 4 plus square root of 8 upon 1 minus square root of 5 upon square root of 20. Let's put 1 upon 2 in place of this part. So it will be square root of 8 upon 1 upon 2. This 2 will multiply here. So we have 4 plus 2 times square root of 8. Now from here we can factor out 2. So it will be upon 2 times 2 plus square root of 8. Now this 2 get cancelled out. So we have 1 upon 2. That's the answer. So option A is the correct answer. Thanks for watching. We will meet in the next one. Bye bye.